History Spotlight, brought to you by HEC Media and the Missouri Historical Society. Hello, I'm Dr. Jody Savile, president of the Missouri Historical Society in St. Louis, and this is History Spotlight. Soldiers Memorial Military Museum is a state-of-the-art museum facility in downtown St. Louis that honors military service, veterans, and their families. Mark Sunlove, director of Soldiers Memorial Military Museum, describes how it is also an architectural gem. Located in the heart of downtown St. Louis, the Soldiers Memorial Military Museum. It's a beautiful building. It's a classical strip style with many art deco flourishes. These flourishes are both inside and outside of the building. Primarily on the outside of the building, of most significance are four statues that were created by Walker Hancock. Walker Hancock was a notable sculptor of the time who, at the time of construction of the Soldiers Memorial, was living in New York City, but was a St. Louisan, and so came back to St. Louis to develop these four monumental statues that grace the building. Walker Hancock, when thinking of this project, thought there were four elements that us as citizens and both the military needed if we were going to be a successful country. He envisioned those as vision, courage, loyalty, and sacrifice, all of these fundamental elements that we need as individuals. Also gracing the outside of the building on the four corners are four urns, and these urns have the 13 official campaigns of World War I. These were the campaigns that our U.S. Army participated in. Along with those 13 campaigns are two recognitions for our service both in Russia and Siberia, both after World War I, and also a notable plaque to the Navy. One of my favorite features of the outside of the building are eagles that grace the steps of the building as you walk up. And these eagles look inward. And for me, that's always been this kind of monumental moment where the U.S. American Eagle is overlooking the steps to Soldiers Memorial, watching who comes into that building and kind of serving as that protectorate or in that uh, role of uh, service and security. Those features along the top of the building, there's a what's called a frieze. And there are 32 individual faces that grace the frieze of Soldiers Memorial. And these faces include the multiple branches and units that served in the war. So nurses and chemical corps and radio corps and the Marines and the Navy, all these different branches grace the building. And then finally, just the building itself and its power and the structure that it represents. And really uniquely, Soldiers Memorial is situated in a part of downtown that's just loaded with this type of beautiful architecture. Right to the north, two blocks to the north, the Central Library, absolutely gorgeous building. And you have Civic Auditorium, which we now know as Stiefel Auditorium, the Civil Courts Building, beautiful City Hall, all of these buildings right in that vicinity of Soldiers Memorial. So if you're interested in architecture and interested in history, uh, that's the place to come. Next week on History Spotlight, the quirky and heated umbrella duel between a journalist and a senator. To learn more about the Missouri Historical Society, visit mohistory.org.